Hello and welcome to this new video tutorial of OpenCart Hotel Booking Discount Plugin. Now this particular plugin will allow the admin to add discount on hotel booking and reservation products. Using this plugin, the OpenCart Web Store admin can add weekend, festive days, day-wise and quantity-based discounts as required on the hotel booking and reservation products there within the store itself. Apart from that, the admin will also be able to create his own weekend and festive days, set the day and person-wise price for the bookings and can set the priority of the discounts as per his own requirement there. Now, kindly note that this particular plugin is an add-on to the OpenCart hotel booking system. So you must first have the OpenCart hotel booking system by Webcool and then you can make use of the hotel booking discount add-on plugin there to uh, add the discounts on the hotel booking and reservation products within your store there. So uh, in today's video tutorial, I'll be showing you the workflow at the customer's end and how the admin would be able to uh, set up the uh, different types of uh, what we say as the discounts like the weekend, festive, day-wise and the quantity-wise discounts. But before we proceed further with this particular video tutorial today, please do subscribe to our channel and press the bell icon to receive the latest updates from our end. And if you find this particular video helpful, then do kindly give it a thumbs up. So right now you can see that I'm on the search page right now for the hotel bookings. I've searched for the hotel rooms there and the complete list of all the hotels are being displayed here as you can see. Now. Uh, if uh, the discounts have been applied to a particular hotel uh, booking and reservation product there then the customers will find a particular button there for the respective uh, hotel booking product there like this one that's the view deal button uh, so here you can see that for the premium room we have the deals there but for the duplex room we don't have any deals similarly for the comfort room we have the deal there for the luxury one we don't have any deals right now so uh, to check the deals the customer just needs to tap here on the view deal button and that brings up this pop-up having the deal details as you can see and it shows the uh, discount details for the uh, hotel booking uh, and reservation product there so here you can see that we have the weekend discount for five percent festive discount day wise discount quantity based discount we also have the price uh, details or the price for the special dates now to check the details for the weekend discount the customer can tap here on the more details and he can check the days uh, of the uh, that have been set as the weekend days so if the customer is uh, making a booking for sunday and saturday there then they'll uh, then the customer would be getting a five percent discount on the booking uh, hotel booking product there similarly for the festive discounts he can tap on the more details there and that would bring up the complete list of date day and the days to go for the festive discounts and for the respective dates if he's going to make a booking then he'll be getting the respective said uh, percentage discount on the hotel booking product there same goes uh, with the uh, day wise discount uh, so here you can see that we have said 25% discount on three day booking so if we are booking a product for three days there then we'll be getting a 25% discount on the uh, hotel booking product there itself and the same goes uh, with the uh, quantity based discount so if uh, we are uh, making five bookings of this particular room there then we'll be getting a 15 percent discount itself and similarly we have the price details for uh, the price for the special dates if i type on the more details here we can find the special dates on which if we are making uh, uh, within which if we are making the uh, uh, bookings there then we'll be getting the respective uh, discounts there so the price has been set so if we are booking between this and this date uh, then we'll be getting the price uh, for the hotel booking product uh, as 200 and so on and so forth there so here you can see that if I go back uh, uh, for the premium room actually it's for $400 there and uh, here we can view the deal there so for example if we check the day wise discount here it says 25% uh, uh, discount on three day booking is there so if I tap here on the book now button there uh, for the premium room there as you can see here and here if I choose uh, the 
uh, check-in date as 8th and the check-out uh, day as uh, 12th there uh, one room and I tap here in the book now button uh, the particular product would be added into the shopping cart now if I go to the shopping cart here you can see the actual uh, unit price is $1600 uh, for the particular product and uh, if we are making the check-in date and the check-in check-out date is uh, for three days or more than three days then we'll be getting a hotel discount there uh, for four hundred dollars itself so that's how the customers uh, can basically view the deals uh, for the hotel booking products there and they can apply uh, the discounts uh, depending upon whether it's a weekend festive day wise quantity wise discount we can also apply uh, what we say as the uh, person wise discount as well so here if I go to the home page once again for example and I choose uh, the start date uh, check-in date and the uh, checkout date and search the hotel rooms there uh, we'll find a complete list of hotels uh, there and here we have already checked the premium room for example if we go with the comfort room here we can see that this particular uh, uh, product that we have the hotel booking one the comfort room it has a deal on it or uh, the discount deal is there here also we have the day wise quantity based uh, discount and here you can see that we have the uh, person wise uh, price as well so for example here you can see that price for one adult is 200 price for two adults is 300 price for three adults is 400 there now uh, for example if I go back the actual price of this is 300 but if I go and try and book this particular product for example and uh, I'll set the uh, adult as one and tap on the book now button uh, and let me go to the shopping cart there and uh, let me remove the premium one that I had added so here you can see the unit price is 800 there and uh, here we are getting a discount of uh, $40 there uh, depending upon the check-in and check-out dates uh, there so that's how the customers can easily uh, apply the discounts uh, there on the hotel booking uh, and reservation products now uh, let me take you to the admin backend panel and let's see how the admin would be able to set up these discounts and the initial configuration settings for this particular uh, plugin as well for more details you can check the live demo that I have attached within the description of this particular video for a better understanding and you can also check the user guide for uh, more details uh, there for the different discounts that would be applicable on the hotel booking product so let's go to the admin backend panel and let's log in by entering the username and the password now after the successful installation of this particular uh, plugin and can you know that this particular plugin is an add-on to the hotel booking and reservation system by webpool so the after you have installed the hotel booking and reservation system by webpool you'll have this particular section with manage hotels add rooms manage fixed facilities and more but after the uh, uh, the installation of the add-on that's the open guard hotel booking discount you will get the managed discount and price option under the hotel booking and reservation system itself so right now you can the thing that you're seeing right now is the initial configuration setting I'll take you through that in a moment from now but first let's go to the managed discount and price so under the managed discount and price here you will be able to collectively see two types of uh, products uh, one is all booking products that would display all of the booking products that are there that you've created and if you go to the discountable products then only the products uh, on which the discounts has have been applied would be visible there now for example if i go with the all booking products here we have all of the booking products now let's check this duplex room and let's edit it up under the manage uh, discount and price system now here you can see that we have two different tabs one is the discount tab and one is the uh, price tab now under the discount tab we have uh, four different uh, discounts that can be applied to this uh, particular uh, hotel booking and reservation product that's the weekend discount festive discount uh, day wise discount and the quantity wise discount as well so from here if you want to uh, set up the weekend discount then you have to enable that up and you can set up the uh, value in percentage here uh, for the discount similarly for the festive discount you'll have to enable it up and set up the festive day discount there 
uh, then we have the day wise discount you'll have to enable it up for the one uh, for the particular product for example uh, you can set uh, the value here you're providing a 10 percent weekend discount uh, for the festive dis day discount you are providing 10 uh, percent discount on the uh, particular booking product uh, then we have the day wise discount so here we can set up the booking days uh, for discount so if you are booking it for three days then we are going to give you a 30 percent discount on the booking there and then we have the quantity wise discount so it depends upon the number of rooms that you're going to book so you can enable it up and then you can set the if you're booking uh, six number of rooms and uh, then what we'll be going is we'll be providing you a 50 percent discount there uh, on the quantity wise discount so this was the uh, uh, weekend discount festive discount uh, the day wise discount and the quantity wise discount now the uh, weekend days the festive days uh, can be set up in the initial configuration settings of this particular plugin that i'll be showing you in a while from now now after the discount we have the price so here you can see that the default price for each uh, and every person and every day is 600 so here we have two different options one is the person wise discount and we have the date wise uh, price so you can enable that up and you can add the from and to values and the price uh, for the particular uh, from and to uh, dates there so date wise price how it applies is that if uh, you are uh, booking uh, within the date from date and to date then the particular price that you have set up would be the price of the hotel booking uh, product there the same goes with the person wise price you can enable this particular functionality and then you can set up price for one person price for two person for example if the actual price of the hotel booking uh, room there is uh, 400 but uh, if you are selecting it for one person you can set it as 200 for two persons you can set it as 100 for three person as 50 for four persons if four persons are there then we'll be providing it for 20 dollars uh, there as per the requirement there and then what you need to do is you just need to tap here in the save button to save the particular discount and the price for the respective hotel booking product that you have selected here under the manage discount and pricing so here you can see that we have the premium and the comfort room if i tap here in the comfort room here we have set up uh, we have not enabled the weekend discount we have enabled the day wise discount for this and the quantity wise discount as we are seeing and under the price uh, we saw that we had said the uh, person wise discount there so if i take you back to the uh, front end there for the comfort room let me take you to the comfort room here and let me search for the rooms first and uh, let the comfort room come up and i tap here in the view deal button here you can see that we have said the day wise discount the quantity wise and here we have set the person wise price as well uh, if one adult is there then $200, two adults $300, three adults we have $400 uh, discount on the hotel booking product itself. So here's the a price, uh, person wise price that we had set up. So that's how you can uh, apply the discounts and the price to the uh, hotel booking and reservation products there. Now coming to the initial configuration settings for that you have to navigate through extensions and under extensions you have to go to order totals. Under order totals, uh, you'll have to scroll down to the hotel booking and reservation discount and here you have to tap on the edit button under the actions column and that will bring up the hotel booking and reservation discount uh, plugins initial configuration settings. Now here what you can do is you can enable the uh, hotel booking and reservation discount uh, feature for your open Gart web store there. Uh, you can set up the sort auto for the hotel booking and reservation discount. You can set the name of the discount so this is what the customers will find when they add the product into the cart so for example uh, if I cross this up and we have the day wise three bookings and we have a five percent discount so if I tap here on the book now button and uh, here I choose the start or the check-in date and then I choose the checkout date and tap here in the book now button uh, you can see that uh, we'll go to the card there 
and here you can see the hotel discount is visible there now the same hotel discount would be uh, visible to the customers at the checkout time as well and after placing the order as well they can find the hotel discount that has been applied uh, to their particular order that they have placed for the hotel booking product there now this uh, hotel discount uh, label is customizable and you can set up it as per own requirement there and this name will be shown in the card for the hotel discount there then we have the option to select the weekend days for the weekend discount so from here you can choose the days uh, or that are the weekend days uh, on which you are going to provide the discounts then we have the festive days so for the festive days uh, let me cancel this out for the festive days you can choose uh, the uh, festive uh, days using the particular calendar there so what you need to do is for example 12th we have a festive day so we can choose 12th uh, then we have 21st then we have 30th so then these festive days uh, would be visible on the uh, hotel booking uh, product there when a customer is trying to make a booking there so that's how you can create the festive days by selecting the dates from the calendar there then we have the discount priority so here you can set up the priority of the discount that should be applicable on the hotel booking product there so here we have the weekend discount festive day wise quantity discount so you can just shuffle whatever you want to take at the highest level so festive discount would be given the first priority if that, uh, set up at the top otherwise we can set up the weekend discount uh, as the first priority then the festive then the quantity and lastly the day wise discount there lastly we have the base price option so here the selected price will be the base price if room has both the person wise price and the date wise price so here you can choose uh, whether to have the date wise price or the person wise price there and accordingly then the selected price will be the base price or if the room has uh, been applied with both the person wise price as well as with the date wise price there and lastly you just need to tap here on the save button to save the configuration settings there so uh, yes that was uh, much about the uh, plugin itself that's the open cart uh, hotel booking uh, discount plugin there and i hope it helped you out in understanding the workflow of the same if you still have any questions queries suggestions or requirements then kindly do reach back to us and support at the rate of webpool.com or you can raise a ticket at webpool.ubidesk.com as well apart from that if you find this particular video helpful then do kindly give it a thumbs up and lastly Thanks for watching this particular video and have a great day ahead.